TF Crew. You know, we actually have happy news for a change. I don't have anything to cl complain about with the views. I have no women to assault to open the show. Um, so it's just me. Shirtless. Um, I, I am happy to announce, though, in the main event, the Puerto Rican Prince will finally defend his world title against Hunter Funk. And if, if you're thinking, why is Hunter getting a world title shot? Well, if you know, you know, during the Backyard Bash, when we were setting up the ring, the metal pole, you know, this is Hunter's head, this is the metal pole, you know, broke him a new skull. And the insurance company called me recently, and uh, they told me that if I don't give Hunter Funk a world title shot, that I was going to get sued. So, uh, listen, I don't have that kind of money. So I'd rather just throw him against the Puerto Rican Prince. And you know what? Maybe he could beat him. I believe in Hunter. I think Hunter could beat him. So, yeah. Hello? Hey! Yeah, hey dumbass. Yeah, no. I know you haven't heard from me in months. Because, you know, why would I ever want to contact you? Speaking of which, um, how do you manage to actually let an insurance policy dictate my next title match? Do you know how important this title is? No, 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 I don't, you don't need to say shit, because you obviously don't understand that, because you haven't held this belt before, because nobody made this belt relevant until I held it. No, 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 it's also the fact that your most viewed event is on my Backyard Wrestling channel, you fucking mark. No, I'm done with this shit. He's your buddy, right? Well, guess what? I hope to God that I retire his ass, and he'll wish that that fucking pull had. You know that? Yeah, well, I'm done with you, and I'm done with this fucking stupid bullshit that you put me through. I'm done. I'm gonna whoop him, I'm gonna whoop him, and I'm gonna come back to Miami just like I always do. And fuck Nick Wayne. Oh, okay. Bye. Idiot. The Golden Boy Kuma. And there was a tale a long time ago about Midas and his touch. Whatever we touch turned to gold. And that's why I'm here in TF Crew. Look at these people. Look at these wrestlers. Look at them. They're just pretty boys. These people are juiced up and they overdose on creatine. But look at me. All natural. Now it doesn't matter who I go against here, TF Crew. I'm going to be on top. You can give me the sloppiest and I'll make them great. I'll make them golden. But I'm going to be on top. That's not an opinion. That's a fact. Because my name is the Golden Boy Kuma. And all I ever needed in this lifetime was to breed to be the best goddamn thing. So you only live within riches, within the force of the lost, my young friend. You can have a family so you don't have to come out here and you don't have to flex on these people and act like a tough guy because we accept you for who you are and what you are, my young friend. So I give you one choice. And all you have to do is say yes to join the force of the lost. Ooh, what do you say? Can you say yes? Make the sloppiest guy? 
They gave me slop? Oh. Sure. Oh. Sure. Oh. 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 Oh.
music. gentlemen i have huge news for the tf crew on hinged rumble number one jeremy lacroix will be making his tf crew debut inside the unhinged rumble looking to bring real man's wrestling back into the professional wrestling world and number two tf crew original christopher black will be also entering the unhinged rumble looking to avenge his loss at death row to become the first tomorrow's end champion the connecticut crippler is looking to cripple his way to a world title shot the time has come we're done waiting for a future that's never coming. If nobody's gonna give us an opportunity, we're gonna take it. We'll do whatever it takes to make sure that at the end of the day, you won't forget the names of the most wanted. Mikey. Williams. And the infamous Jason Chambers.
of all ages. But the clock is ticking. Time is running out. Once Stefan Havoc shows up, everything changes for the TF crew. His presence is like a dark cloud that instantly alters the atmosphere. The crew, once confident and coordinated, finds themselves disoriented and outmaneuvered. And the realization hits, they've been caught in his venomous web. I'm here to save you all. I'll save you! Take my hand. I'll lead the way. And save you all. You think of all things I wanted to do that day? I want to be taking photos? No. I could have been facing the best backyard wrestler I have ever witnessed in my entire life. Don June 15th, I was struck in the head with an 80 pound steel pole! Any average man would have died from that incident, but not me, cause I'm no average man! Goddamn medicine!
Fuck you. 